So they hit Trump with his third indictment, right? And I can tell you, they're trying to break him down, right? The, the timing has to be intentional. Kind of like some strategy to, 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 to hinder the campaign movement or something. <clears throat> like to, to kick him when he's down, you know? It, even though he got a lot of supporters, he probably got more haters. Trump probably got more haters than any American. And even less in betweeners. You know, it's either you love the guy, you support the guy, or you fucking hate him. You know what I mean? But let's check out this uh this video and see what this indictment is talking about. So there's a All lot right, Jonathan of Jonathan Turley, I'm gonna interrupt you there. again, which is very rude, and I'm gonna owe you a drink. We wanna to get to David Spun. Oh. He actually has the indictment. <laughs> owe you he a can drink. read it to us, tell us what are the charges or David Spun, there you go. Over to and you. we got the printer we got the printer going behind me. Forty five pages, here it is right here. Um, Donald Trump has been indicted. There are four different counts. I want to read them to you before I read through this. Uh, count one is conspiracy to four, four counts. Let's see. Let's see if they got some shit that's going to stick. Because cause if you don't remember the first two, they weren't able to fuck with Trump. None of that shit was able to stick on Trump. He They threw a million daggers at Trump, man, and he literally came out unscathed. So let's see if they, they got some shit that can actually stick, because I'm pretty sure they probably reaching. To defraud the United States, count two, conspiracy to obstruct an official proceeding. Count three, obstruction of an attempt to obstruct an official proceeding. And then count four is called conspiracy again against rights. So I'm gonna go through this and look at it right now. We just sent it out so everybody the should have a uh, copy in our email. But right now it appears four different counts. Uh, this was the indictment that was not read in court, now is unsealed. Uh, and we're waiting to see if we get any type of reaction from special counsel Jack Smith will be watching for. Dana. Do you know, understand, but earlier, to, earlier you said that there were, the indictments didn't have some initials or some people were named. What happened to that? Is now everybody named? Not everybody was named. Apparently, we're told from our producer in the courtroom, there were two cases uh, where initials were read. We're deciphering who those initials may be. We're waiting to see if we find those. But this specific case right here, uh, there was no DT read or DJT or Donald Trump announced in the courtroom. And this just says United States of America v. Donald J. Trump defendant. So it does not have other defendants listed in this indictment. We were wondering if perhaps it might be Donald Trump and XYZ, as we saw uh, with the uh, retention of documents case where his aide and body man, Walt Nauta, was also indicted. This right here is just United States of America versus Donald Trump. It's four counts. Again, count one, conspiracy to defraud the United States. Count two, conspiracy to obstruct an official proceeding. Count three is obstruction of an attempt to obstruct an official proceeding. <laughs> Count four is conspiracy right. against rights. It is 45 pages. And on the back, it has Jack Smith's uh, signature right here. Okay. And um, it just says right here, it says Donald J. Trump. This is on the final page. Did knowingly combine, conspire, conf confederate, and agree with co-conspirators known and unknown to the grand jury to injure, oppress, threaten, and intimidate one or more persons in the free exercise and enjoyment of a right and privilege secured to them by the Constitution. Constitution and laws of the United States. Who said injure, oppress, threaten, and intimidate? So that means if they got some credible witnesses, he might not come out unscathed. But I would assume that that the st the status of of Donald Trump, they would definitely check every witness's credibility to the best of their ability. You know what I mean? Um, you know what I think about this? I think if 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 Donald Trump gets off. And they're not able to stick nothing to him. They might as well leave this man alone. You know, I, it, it just it seemed like a, a whole lot of reaching. You know, if they, they get this shit handled with an unbiased, 
You know what I mean? And if, if you can't stick nothing on the man, leave him the fuck alone. Quit, quit digging for shit, man, that, that don't exist. But I do want you to know I'm, I'm not a Trump supporter. I didn't vote for Trump and I wouldn't vote for Trump. I'm just, just throwing my two cents out there.